We got an early look at the upcoming Air Jordan UNC player exclusive. At the end, I'm going to go ham on a rant with YouTube. Just warning you. <laughs> subscribe if you're new and hit that little bell next to the subscribe button. I hate even saying it. It's so ridiculous. This is part of the reason why you will get a rant at the end of this video. And if you don't care for it, then that's all good. You came here for the sneakers, I understand. That's why I'm going to hit you with that review. Bang. Let's get to the shoes. In my opinion, if you're a UNC fan, these are a must-have. They released a player exclusive a couple of years ago, and it was pretty awesome. And this one is just as great. Looking up close, you have your knit upper right there. And I love how it looks. You've got your lace system. Check it out. Going up to the top. With your chromed out Air Jordan Wings logo. Looks great. Nice pop to the shoe. You've got this synthetic panel on the side. And then you've got this marbled midsole. With your Jumpman right there. This marbled look looks really awesome on it. It gives it a lot of life. Digging it. Translucent on the outsole. You've got your zoom unit with your Jumpman. you got your flight speed plate. With your heels logo right there. I love it. I love it. And then on the back, which is really awesome, you have the different dates. I'm pretty sure these are all the dates that they won championships, and I think that's really great. I mean, I may be wrong, but I'm pretty sure I'm right. <laughs> Taking a look at the medial side of the shoe, I recommend going true to size, and I think true to size is the move. Unless you have a wide foot, then go up half a size, but if not, definitely stay true to size. Metallic tips with 23, and I love that. The scissors cut in the net right there behind the tongue. And then look at that footbed, man. If you're a UNC fan, you got to get these. It's as simple as that. That's my personal opinion. Let me know who you like better, Duke or UNC. Leave that in the comment box below. I am a UNC guy. I just started really getting into college basketball the past four to five years. Before that, when I was a kid, though, which is funny, I always wore a Duke jacket when the starter jackets were real popular back in the 90s. I had the Blue Devils jacket. That thing was so dope. That was badass. That jacket had the big-ass Blue Devil on the back. I remember people were sweating that jacket. Not to be, like, arrogant or whatever. Uh, I don't know what the word is, but um, that jacket was so dope back in the days. I remember people being like, damn, that jacket's tough. But I never was a real fan of Duke. I just wore the jacket because I thought that blue devil in the back was so mean. But get back to these shoes. I definitely recommend them if you are a UNC fan. And they will be hitting retailers very soon. I will have more information on the release in the description box below. And I will continue to update it. For some reason, the info ain't in the description box. You just beat me to it. It was uploading. I didn't get a chance to put it in the description box yet. So just come back like 30 minutes later, 20 minutes later. It'll be updated. And I got to get into a little bit of a rant now because I'm very frustrated with YouTube. You know, every single video now, I got to remind people to hit the stupid little bell next to where it says subscribe or subscribe. Depending on if you just subscribed or not, or if you've been subscribed. It's to the point now where I just am getting so fed up with the fact that the only way for my subscribers that I've earned for almost a decade to get notified is now if they hit the bell. If they don't hit the little bell, the only way they get notified is if they go into their YouTube section, then click on to where it says subscribe, and then scroll through their subscribers. If you're a subscriber, you should get notified. You shouldn't have to do all this extra BS now, hitting the bell, all this crap. I really, really am getting tired of YouTube, honestly. The only thing that's keeping me on here is you, the people. So like for people that really don't ever want to see me go, make sure you always leave comments. Make sure you hit the thumbs up button because really honestly, like as much as I love shoes, YouTube is really pissing me off. Like really, really pissing me off. I My videos should be getting out there way more than they do and they're not. I have people I run into at malls, even at the grocery store, Target, and they're like, Dells, man, I seen the last video you did and they're mentioning a video from like, a month ago like I drop a video every day almost you know how frustrating that is it's so frustrating 
And I've had a lot of people ask me, yo, how come you don't do podcasts anymore? And one of the big reasons why I did it, why I stopped was because it's a lot of work recording an hour and a half and then making a video and uploading it on YouTube. It's a lot easier for me to upload it on a server and just put the audio out there. And it's kind of nice for a lot of people. They can listen to it in their car or at home while I'm talking about sneakers, sports, uh, wrestling, collectibles, movies, whatever. You know, that's how the podcast was. And I just stopped because for me to upload the audio was costing me money because I have to pay the server. And then for me to post this on YouTube was taking a lot of time, man. It's a lot of time to do that with a hour to two hour podcast. There is a site though. Some people may know about it. Some may not know about it. It's called Patreon. Patreon.com backslash DJ Dells is now open. Join the Patreon. I will give you guys at least one hour every single week. A podcast every single week if you join the Patreon. Plus, I will do one giveaway every month. It's not going to be a sneaker giveaway, but it will be a collectible. It will be something that's dope. I mean, if you really are into me to the point where you're going to join the Patreon, which I expect like all my die-hard followers to join it, I just can't see why you wouldn't. If you're going to get at least four hours of me a month, I, I can't see why anyone would pass on that. So right now, everyone, check out that site, patreon.com backslash DJ Dells. Sign up if you're not signed up to the site and then join my Patreon. You will get four podcasts every single month on the weekend they will release and you could download them and they will continue to be there so you can listen to them over and over again and also you'll have that one giveaway they have an app and it's really convenient you download it you can link it to your car when you're driving you can link it to your headphones and listen to it if you're in the gym or if you're at home it's really awesome so you know if you're new to hearing about this patreon thing you may be like what the hell is Dells doing man just stay on YouTube what the hell is wrong with this guy right now talking about all this other stuff I'm gonna continue doing YouTube videos but this is for the die-hard supporters of the show the people that love what I do that follow me on Instagram love when I go live and the really cool thing about with this patreon is if you join that will make you a producer of the show. Now, I know some of you guys are going to be like, what the hell is he talking about, producer of the show? Let me explain. When you join the Patreon, you will become a producer of the podcast. Now, the week before I record the podcast, I will put a post. What do you guys want this podcast to be about? And then that will be all up to you guys. You guys let me know. Do you want me to speak about sneakerheads, other sneakerheads, sneaker culture? Um, what did I think about the last Star Wars movie to, uh, you know, The Walking Dead to Funko Pop? You know, I collect a ton of those to tips on anything, anything you guys want me to speak about. WWE. I'm open to speaking about anything. You guys mold the show. So basically, you guys will be the producers and letting me know what kind of content to put on the show and it's going to be a members only thing where the only way you're going to listen to this is if you're joined it will not be on youtube the pot the entire podcast will not be on youtube so the only way you're going to hear it is through patreon so head over to that site right now and thank you to everyone that's already joined it's fairly new i don't have many many people that have joined yet but there's gonna be a lot more it's gonna be a lot of fun and i'm also thinking about doing like a little like music segment where every week i play a patreon member's music and then the patreons will judge if it's hot or not so um if you're an artist out there let me know and maybe we'll do something with that i'm not gonna play the whole song I, no one wants to hear a whole damn song on a podcast but we'll play like the hook and the verse and it'll be fun you know you may get trashed though people may just trash the shit out of your song or they may love the song so um if you join the patreon we'll play it no matter what i don't care what it sounds like because if it's terrible it's going to be really entertaining for the patreons and for the members of the patreon so it's going to be fun and if it's hot then people are probably going to want to download your song so i've got a lot of different ideas going on 
you guys let me know what you want it to be about not in the comment box here on youtube as i said this is different than youtube i'm moving away from youtube i'm still gonna be here but i gotta get the f out of youtube and do other stuff and my first goal is to put on this patreon show and then i'm gonna move to another platform and i'm gonna just keep putting content all over the internet because honestly the internet is becoming way bigger than just youtube i mean youtube has gone so commercial now it's made me sick to my stomach if you look at it they're shutting down youtube channels that shouldn't be shut down i mean they just shut down that dude name brand that's really whack they shut him down shout out to that dude like it's really terrible why are you censoring people that's why youtube was so dope people were able to just put out content and now you guys are controlling everything youtube when i mean you guys i'm talking about youtube they're like controlling and censoring and that sucks you know that's what separated youtube from everything else now i feel like youtube is trying to be like different kind of version of netflix and that's just not what youtube should be about i mean it's frustrating someone that's been a creator for so long it's just really it's sad it's really sad but um you know i'm gonna keep doing the vids because people still like watching them so don't worry still gonna get that positive vibe that energy i never did the videos for money ever like when i first started youtube i never did it for money i didn't even know you can make money on youtube i was one of the first to do youtube sneaker videos money started coming it was great money started declining because of the adpocalypse and all types of crap like that and youtube not informing all my subscribers and yeah that did suck the income went up and then went down but it's all good because i love doing this i love entertaining you all you know if you hung out for this whole video that's really awesome you did and if you cut out early you just wanted to see the sneaker that's cool too man definitely check the patreon right now i really would love to see some more members so check that out much love we out